It's our toughness off the field. On the field. Our effort all the time. Every time. It's our focus. And our discipline. It's our tradition. And seminal pride. It's our turn. To make them feel the spirit. Because it's not their time. This is our turn. People ask me all the time. They say to me, what is the secret to success? The first rule is trust yourself. But what is most important is that you have to dig deep down, dig deep down and ask yourselves, who do you want to be? Not what, but who. And I'm talking about not what your parents and teachers want you to be, but you. I'm talking about figuring out for yourselves what makes you happy, no matter how crazy it may sound to the people. Number one is, of course, trust yourself no matter how and what anyone else thinks. And of course, rule number two is break the rules. We have so many rules in life about everything. I say break the rules, not the law, but break the rules. It is impossible to be a maverick or a true original if you're too well behaved and not want to break the rules. You have to think outside the box. That's what I believe after all. What is the point of being on this earth? If all you want to do is be liked by everyone and avoid trouble. The only way that I ever got any place was the breaking some of the rules. Which of course brings me to rule number three. Don't be afraid to fail. Anything I've ever attempted, I was always willing to fail. So you can't always win, but don't be afraid of making decisions. You can't be paralyzed by fear of failure or you will never push yourself. You keep pushing because you believe in yourself and in your vision. And you know that it is the right thing to do and success will come. So don't be afraid to fail. Which brings me to rule number four, which is don't listen to the naysayers. I mean, how many times have you heard that you can't do this and you can't do that and it has never been done before? I love it when someone says that never, no one has ever done this before because then when I do it, that means that I'm the first one that has done it. So pay no attention to the people that say it can't be done. I never listen that you can't. I always listen to myself and say, yes, you can. And that brings me to rule number five, which is the most important rule of all. Of all. Work your butt off. Believe leaving no stone unturned. Muhammad Ali, one of my great heroes, had a great line in the 70s when he was asked, how many sit-ups do you do? He said, I don't count my sit-ups, I only start counting when it starts hurting. When I feel pain, that's when I start counting, because that's when it really counts. That's what makes you a champion. That's the way it is with everything. No pain, no gain. So, yeah, partying, horsing around. Someone out there at the same time is working hard. Someone is getting smarter and someone is winning. Just remember that. Now, if you want to win, there's absolutely no way around hard, hard work. None of my rules, by the way, of success will work unless you do. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, now go out and get what you're worth. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you wanna be because of him or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that.
call myself the best player, but when I step on the field, I don't believe there's anybody that can stop me. I don't say that out of arrogance. I say that out of, out of confidence. I don't allow myself to think that anybody can. That's called courage. Now that's the stuff leaders should be made of. Is that too much to ask? Are we asking too much to ask? Is it beyond our reach? Because if it is, then we are nothing but sheep being herded to the final slaughterhouse. I will not go down that way. I choose to fight back. Going through the motions is the most disadvantageous thing that you could do. That often when you do something wrong the first time, you have to go back and do it right the second time. Whereas if you did it right the first time, you never have to do it again. And all successful people realize that.